And welcome back to another pew 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 watch out for the rocket wait we're not playing that game we're playing modern skyblock 2 so we have updated to another new version with uh, a couple of mods added a couple of mods no no mods removed but we did get a few config changes which I don't even know what they are so we'll continue on and find out what they are um Last time, I can't remember what we did. It's been like over a day since I recorded due to work, uh, work uh, with my son and some more work. And it's 11:44 currently, so I thought I'd sneak in a one or two episodes. I think. Um, I know we now have our red uh, AA set up, so we can do some redstoneia quickly, or we might look into power. Okay, I might just quickly turn my music down a little, because it's quite loud. Oh no, I'll turn my headphones down, sorry. Because it's blaring into my ears. So now I can actually hear. So, um... Oh, wow, look at the size of our mana pool. This is nearly full. So this is really, really good. Um... I didn't actually let it run that long um, without doing anything. It was about half an hour, I think it was, when I was off doing something. Uh, that's right, I was helping my brother with the Wi-Fi in the shed. So since there, there's a big shed and it's massive and no wi uh, signals come in and out very clearly, so there's a separate Wi-Fi down that end of the yard. So uh, let's have a quick check. Ooh. Well, we found out what was happening in there. They were fighting. So it's about time we actually got a uh, myself, not ourselves, because you're not playing. That's right. So we want to get the Botania set of armor because it's just really good armor. It doesn't actually add any toughness just as yet. Um. It does add in, I think it's the Terra Steel one. Yeah, the Terra Steel one is the one where you actually get this set. This one, I don't know what this one is actually for. So, I think it's the Greater Fairy's Blessing, Will of the Ancients. So, I think they're just different sets do different things. So, 10% less mana cost on mana tools and rods. So this one actually has passive mana generation in tablets as well. So what does this one have? So this basic one is just your basic set. So that's not too bad I guess. There's lots of enchantment that you can do. So don't know what you can. But to get it is just 5 mana steel plus another 8 which is 13 plus another 6 is 19 uh, 20 and 24 total in mana steel mana steel, I mean iron, and then you convert it to mana steel, we have enough wow, look at the iron I think we have enough iron so let's just whack that back in there and we'll go convert this over to Mana steel, so we actually have some armor. Now we need to make a tablet to fill our mana up with it. So we will make one of them and fill the tablet. So let's just make uh, some sets. Yeah, that's it. There's the helmet, and then there's the pump, ah, the boots. So let's actually. Oh. There we go. So. Ah, yeah. There you go. You, we, we don't look that good. I think I might have to see if an older version will run on it. 1.11.2, I think there is a, a mod pack. But look at our armor. Down here. Uh, yeah. It's like plus two there. Six there, five there, seven there, and our 
it's, it's yellow, it's a different different look. Interesting. So we'll quickly grab our diamond from here. And I'm pretty sure to make a tablet. It's been a while since I made a mana tablet. Yeah, so it's just a mana diamond around it. So a mana diamond with living rock around it. Oh, I'll have to make some more living rock, won't I? And then that will be our tablet. One, one, and bam, our tablet. Now, let's see what this is on. This is, now this is it. Now that will pick it up. So, how much? I think we're out of coal. So while that fills up, we'll quickly run over here and we'll get some of this magical wood. It just keeps randomly appearing. <laughs> uh, you think it's magical, because it is. So on the way past, we'll just grab this and see what it's at. It actually is nearly full, so we'll chuck it back down. And we'll whack these in here. And then one, two, three, four, five. See, this is why this is just absolutely great, this. Now we have a full mana tablet, and we just put that to the side. Um, I think eventually we can get a ring that does exactly the same thing as that, but I don't know. Yeah, so you can't put it in. Ooh, that's our right hand though. I guess that could give us a spot and just look funny walking around with our tablet. But okay, so we got this. Now I can actually make a piston. Well, no, actually I can't because since we entered, oops, wrong one. We've entered the smeltery stage where we can actually smelt stuff. So um, uh, you can actually make. Where is it? There's plates and yeah, see thermal expansion frames. So we've done Botania, we've entered it, but we haven't quite got into it because later on we'll be actually you quite use quite a bit of stuff to help us. Um, but we're in actual editions, which we have completed. That was actually quite easy. Um, I love the uh, lasers for power, uh, the items and the fluids. I, I've actually never used item transferring. I've only used fluids. So yeah, but we now to get into evil craft, which um, yeah, I'm not very familiar with it. I did get into it into um, last map where um, where was it? You needed a couple of buckets of blood around it. So, do I actually have a bucket on me? I do not, and I need to make a tank. So, let's make a tank. There we go. I like, I like these, these tanks. Um, but unfortunately, they don't have uh, Ender-IO in here, so it saddens me because them tanks are awesome too, but I'm not too overly um, sad about them not being in here. It's a good pack, or good mod pack, sorry. But you can live without it, especially if you've got this mod pack. I need some glass too, or Tinker's installed. It gives you another option of a decent tank in it as well. So I'll probably, I do have them in here, but I'll whack that in there, I'll grab this out. So, I'm wondering if my 2.4 million... So that's not keeping up with just one, so we may want to think about a second one. No, actually it's three glasses now, isn't it? Oh, I don't want that many, I only want two. And there's our two tanks. I oh, don't want to do that. Now, there is a couple of ways of actually getting blood. Um, 
we will be getting around to doing one of them actually permanently. So over the, under the mob drop spawner you can just get it dropped and then have a little bit of something on the bottom to uh, kill them as you would say. Um, or you can actually do it this way. Oops. Uh, I'll just grab them two meat sticks. But the other way... You come all the way over to this smell tree and you go fill. And this will actually turn into blood. Uh, I don't know where it says what type of blood it is, uh, but it is blood anyway. So you just keep whacking it in there. So the easiest way to do it is add a hopper. Uh, if I have one, which I probably don't. Oh well, we will quickly make a hopper. And there's a hopper. So we will put this away, this away, and that away. Uh, we will grab out a fluid. I don't think we have a servo. We do have. Uh, I'll just do a, a normal servo. that and we'll fill that up and then grab this put that down and and then we run and there you go this will actually fill up with blood so that is awesome we will put away this uh, the block of quartz can go away too that can go away that can go bin and we'll do this. I actually need to make some tinkerer's glass over there eventually as well. So it's not just that what we need um, that's in there just for blood. It, that one will be for actually a, some... Yeah, I don't like that tablet being there. That's annoying. <laughs> uh, um, it will be for other things as well. Um, in eventually an automation stage when we actually kick into that I will be making another smeltery so they can actually handle that off and I thought I had a spare bucket, I don't think I do we have enough clay to make another bucket just take that and this and we need to go to our and we need to get uh, is it a dark gem? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a dark gem. And with this dark gem, you make yourself a relatively big pool. It's only temporary. So, a nice big pool. Oh. See, the other way, the one that I did is I actually had my mob drop straight on it and just let it fill with a pipelet that just kept pumping out and in a circular system to. Um, uh, keep the uh, blood in there and uh, seared brick I think it was liquid to kill them because you have to have some form of liquid in the bottom but for some reason the liquid was not actually uh, draining it properly because I told seared to stay in there and I'll swap it over every now and then but it just kept draining everything which was annoying uh, just having a drink so eventually we will have a smell tree over there but for now we will just do this I mean we're already halfway there and we'll just keep going through this making sure this is going and the other tank that I wanted to make is for this like that bam so basically emergency lava as I call it so if I need to refill another smell tree or something eventually that I don't have pipes to um, 
I'll probably end up moving the other this smeltery over to there once I clear all that out so they're near each other for so, uh, for lava gen and I'll just end up making a heap of um, blaze. I don't even know. Yeah, this has already been cooked up. Now that doesn't really last long, does it? I'll have to get some more. With ideas, which is easy to make. Actually, I might do two packs and dump that and that. Makes so much that efficiency, it's awesome. Let Minecraft count how many times I did it. I don't know how many it forces into there, but this will force the whole whatever into that stack. So, and this is smelting that quick. This can't actually keep up. So that's good. So this may actually take quite a few rotten flesh to make into blood. But all we need to do is just start it off and then I'll whack in a heap of um, brick in there to actually convert it. Because we need this no matter what. So we'll end up filling this in I think. And then building a smeltery around the mob drop using a range collector to pick it all the items up. The only problem is we'll probably need more power. So and usually I would go and try and push myself straight to making a magma and a fluid transporter or transposer whatever it is to no I think you only need a magma yeah to make redstone so I can actually make the garden cloche because we should be able to make them soon so I mean you need to make a thing wires not too bad I mean I could actually I oh, know I can't because I need pistons and to make pistons you need a little bit more into um, hmm. uh, induction smelter. No, 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 no. There's a liquid that you can get They're here. Destabilize liquid in the magma. So, but I need Dawnstone, which I need a bucket. So, if I can get a uh, empowered, just the basic one, even if I can just push to it, you need blood. Uh, uh, sorry, an eye of resident blood orb, red netherrack, which is actually quite easy to do now. Um, the blood orb is just blood in the blood infuser with a uh, glass and iron from that. A promise is actually quite easy to make. That's in here as well. Bowl of emptiness is three dark gems, so you, you need you need to get your smeltery up and running pretty quick to get there. Oh, that's all empty. That's all empty, and I ended up with oh, so close. I oh, know it's five buckets, isn't it? Uh, one, two. And five, and then you chuck your gem in. Could be the wrong gem. Uh, yeah, it might be the wrong gem. They will actually. This heart, uh, blood will end up congealing soon. But. Dark gem. Uh, pretty sure it's that one. Used to have a tag, yeah. Ah, oh. dark powered gem. Uh, 
Yeah, so you throw a dark gem in a pool of metal. Before it wasn't working and then it did work, I had to pick up and place the blood again. I don't know. Took me a while to actually get it all working. have to get the book first. Doesn't say how many it needs. at least five blocks of non-hardened see so there are five blocks in there of non-hardened I got it done before but maybe I need the book to actually do it I forgot I had to get a book uh, oh I've accidentally replaced a, a block of blood <sighs> it's really hard to tell sometimes it gets a little bit confusing to do and I'm nearly out of meat so I may have to end up moving um, that over hmm I wonder because for me to get I need to do uh, feed enamel a darkened apple uh, and throw a book at it once it's dead hmm because I've got that stupid cat over there that I could maybe able to do but I need some leather now leather and paper. I don't know if I've got any paper yet, but uh, not that one. Uh, okay. That and actually need some of them. Fifteen sawdust. And we need some water. Now, I think it was four. Yes. This will give us one book. Oh, that's right. I could have done it out of um. Uh, rice, couldn't I? And there's a book. Now I need a dark, a dark and apple, which is basically a gem and an apple. Do I have? I do have an apple here. So you and you, dark and apple. Have a decent sword. And it looks like the cat must have went walkabouts because it was there. But oh well. 
how many gems do I have? Not gems, emeralds. I only have three emeralds. So there goes Pam's Harvest Crust. I know. Hmm. I know if I make a grass patch. How much dirt? I only got nine dirt. How much? I got four in there. Uh, 64 here. Let's go make some more dirt. I wonder if how much I got in here. Did I leave? No. Okay. So you and you can go in there. You can go in there. Five dirt at the moment. Let's go clean up my inventory a little. I'll just whack that in there. And I will whack that in there. And then keep that, put that away, that away, keep that, put that, 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 keep. And put you in there. Okay. So what we're really waiting for now is just the dirt and I will make a nice big dirt patch with this and I need a grass seed as well, don't I? Uh, there we go, one of them. I don't know if I need the alchemy catalyst under it or it works straight away uh, with it. Nice. Because um, this is going to be my farmland anyway. I will extend it a little bit. I will grab my both my wands out because I don't know which one will work. Hopefully I'll get rid of my stone one straight away. So and we'll need to do this first. So the wand recognizes what I'm doing. And cool, the stone one will. Not as big as you would hope it would be, but it's better than nothing. So we'll just keep clearing this. Well, not clearing, but filling. Yeah, um. Hmm. There we go. She's gone. And I'm actually out of stone. So I'll straighten this up, uh, this up. There we go, and F7 so we can see where to put the torches, because we don't want mob spawning, because that's just bad. Okay, there we go. So what I'll do is from this corner, one, two, uh, I don't know how many long this will be actually. Um, how about we just do nine, hey? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And then we'll do a torch. And then let's just fill this out. There we go. We have a kind of uh, uh, grass platform. I don't actually know how big the platform has to be for it to actually spawn animals, but I know it has to be about that big. I will grind up some more sand. Actually, I have sand there. It's the green orbs I need. Six. Uh, I think I need more than that. Oh, not quite. Need another layer out there. Oh. I've only got 261 in there. Ah, because that. So 
So we just quickly right kick that and whatever's in there will get unstuck. Because yeah, it is full. I'll just take it with me. And now the sand should be coming, or oh, that should be coming, and I probably need more sand or dirt. So I need to make a lot. Oh, there's a spot here. See, this is why you need F7 on. So you can see. Spot the infidels. Um. I have to use this dirt that will have to spread anyway. What am I doing? Uh, we still got some spot for dirt, but what I actually want to get is one, two, three, four, five. This will actually give lots and lots of them. So just drag them up for now and then move them around like that. And bam, lots. Anyway, it's wrapping up point time, so I will go continue on making another episode after this one so pretty much just fixing the base up really more dirt there make more dirt over there start of uh, blood stuff how much did I get 5.7 not enough so yeah I will see you next episode <laughs>